Maui's grim new milestone, now the deadliest wildfire disaster in modern U.S. history. New video from Tuesday night of the wind-whipped inferno shows how people cowered at the seawall for hours as fast-moving flames burned much of Lahaina to the ground. The fire taking the life of Carol Hartley. She was beautiful. She was beautiful in her own way. She had a heart of gold. And she cared about other people more than herself. 68-year-old Franklin Trejos died after staying behind, trying to save his home and help others. Unimaginable loss and with hundreds still unaccounted for. ABC's Will Carr going to one of the family assistance centers where people are searching for their loved ones. This man looking for his 98-year-old aunt. What was the last you heard? She was at the senior center in Lahaina. Being evacuated? Yes. It also burned down. There's growing frustration and questions about why warnings were never sent out. The Hawaii Emergency Management Agency confirming the island's comprehensive siren systems, often used to warn of possible tsunamis, were not activated. Hawaii's governor says the fire traveled one mile every minute, with winds clocked between 60 and 81 miles per hour. When the fire sparked, there were several fires across Maui. One fire was deemed to be out. It must not have been completely extinguished. The community calling for accountability. One class action lawsuit has been filed, accusing power companies of leaving their power lines energized when they knew there was a risk of high fire danger. Hawaiian Electric telling us they cannot comment on pending litigation and that the cause of the fire has not yet been determined. So access out here to Lahaina is only for emergency road crews, but there are hundreds of FEMA workers, American Red Cross workers, search and rescue crews that still are arriving onto this island and so much critical need and resources are needed here. Uh, luckily, some of that aid coming in, but still so much more to go. John. I need so much help there. Melissa Don live for us. Thank you.